Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. A very, very warm welcome to uh, Sotheby's during Freeze Week. Without further ado, we're going to start the bidding with lot number one. Bidding was particularly strong tonight at the beginning of the sale. We opened with a group of works by younger artists, Wade Guyton, Nate Lohman, Alex Hubbard and Herman Anderson. They all achieved extraordinary results tonight. The highlights for me tonight were the Glen Brown, Ornamental Despair, a painting for Ian Curtis. And I'm going to start the bidding here at £1,500,000. It was an extraordinary work and really for me particularly exciting to be part of such a bidding war between myself and my colleague Alex Rotter going against one another to try and get the painting. Salty, thank you very much indeed. The other highlight for me was the Andreas Gursky Paris Montparnasse, something that we have dreamed of bringing to auction for many years. There were two sales here this evening. We started with the 20th century Italian art sale. The top lot of the Italian sale was the cover lot, the amazing Fontana Conchita Spaziale from 1960. The Italian sales go from strength to strength, and particularly this evening, an extraordinary result, and we're delighted, of course. I think October in London has become such an important season for the art world. It's when everybody's here. What was amazing tonight for me was just to see a much younger generation, my generation, collectors bidding aggressively in the sale room. And that's the great thing about this week in London at Freeze. It's much more accessible, it's much more about younger artists and a younger generation of collectors. And we really saw that tonight. People from all over the world bidding aggressively to acquire great works of art, particularly by younger artists. Thank you very much indeed.